Any problems coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Who, Mr. Milton's friends? Yeah, they've had patrols out ever since you boys disappeared. You know that part. I do. And how's I, uh... So that, too. Well, we got Lenny's body out as well. Robbed the morgue and buried them together. Follow me. your plan here well i figure before we do anything few moments late so i guess it ain't all gone to shit oh, she a beauty ain't she from here on the ground yes mr bullard hmm. mr bullard ah mrs adler it's good to see you good to see you ah uh, this is my friend i told you about mr morgan ah Yes, Arturo Bullet, at your service, sir, at your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, and Icarus would have made it across the sea. Ha, ha, ha. Have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah. Uh, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. Yes. <laughs> okay. Here goes nothing. Right. Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. One hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. Okay, Mr. Bullard. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. For a friend of mine. A friend? Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. say the specifics of this job were not described to me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. 